today we're going to be talking about something that kind of upsets me. It might not upset you guys that much, but you know, as a content creator, I know I'm not that big, but what's the goal in the end? To gain subscribers, right? And you know, <laughs> I'm going through a tough time, but honestly, I love doing this. Even if I don't gain that many subs, I'm probably still going to do this like five years down the line. Who knows? Maybe I'll do this to the day I die. As fucking corny as that sounds. But you know, content creators deal with this thing called copyright all the time. And you know, copyright, it sounds good on paper and it does have some good to it like copyright basically protects content creators and their work it helps them give permission to certain people to distribute their work which i don't have a problem with but copyright is becoming something that it's not supposed to be copyright is something that isn't even about protecting the creators anymore it's about harming people as fucking crazy as that sounds i actually mean it you know and <laughs> With something like this coming into play, what I'm about to talk about, it would be even harder for someone like me to even gain like any type of success on YouTube, you know? Basically, one of these senators named Tom Tillis, he proposes a law that would make any type of copyright infringement a felony. Copyright infringement is like playing music that you don't own, you know? Like, for example, let's say that you're reacting to videos on your Twitch stream and one, an ad comes up with like a Post Malone song. Basically, even if it was only for a couple seconds, that's considered copyright infringement. It's like if you're playing Super Mario Bros and uh <laughs> Oh, dude, I'm gonna get copyrighted for that. <laughs> you know, his little theme song comes on. If you hear that, that's considered copyright infringement. You know, even at that, there's things that are considered copyright infringement that aren't even copyright infringement. There's been cases of people getting copyrighted for hearing horns in the background. You guys hear about that story of that guy being copyrighted for having a blender in his video, and apparently it sounded like a Skrillex song? It's getting out of hand. Copyright already has a lot of problems, and they're just adding to it. Wow, like, do these people have nothing better to do that? They want to make copyright infringement a felony? Let me give you a couple examples of what a felony is. Felonies can be things such as murder, rape, burglary, kidnapping, and arson. So these people are trying to put copyright infringement on the same pedestal as killing someone, raping someone, robbing someone's house, kidnapping someone, or lighting someone or something on fire. Does that not give off red flags to any of you? If something like this is actually to pass and this Tom to the Sky is successful, this greedy senator then content creators as a whole would be fucked this would fuck everyone over and what's sad is he's not even doing it because he believes in it he's doing it because there's people giving him money like for example someone that helped fund his campaign is comcast slash xfinity the company one of the fucking greediest companies out there you know the company that charges you like 200 dollars for internet that can barely even let two people use ps4s it's sad because this guy you could see who helps him fund his campaigns and who's in his pockets and it's nothing but labels and entertainment groups that have copyrighted work it's sad because this bill isn't even about protecting their creators it's about being greedy fuck like imagine getting a felony over playing a song and your story on snapchat that's basically what this is implying you can get a felony for playing music or something that you don't own for a couple seconds on your story i mean like fuck might as well put everyone in america in jail because i promise you anyone that has a snapchat they've played music in the background they're at when they're at a party or they're at a restaurant and there's always music on like it's impossible to not come in contact with music that's not yours like fuck dude just put everyone in jail at this point it's sad because are these senators and these people in congress this fucking bored to the point where this is what they're talking about like nope coronavirus nope oh yes copyright that's definitely something that needs to be brought up the copyright system is already fucked up as it is people are always getting copyrighted for things that shouldn't be copyrighted but you know it still happens i've heard of people being copyrighted for public domain songs dude i have been copyrighted for using a free to use non-copyright beat but some other idiot uses the exact same beat and try to copyright it when he puts his little vocals over it the whole copy copyright system is already fucked up as it is and something like this shouldn't even be implied when the system's not even perfect as it is ah oh, dude it just all comes down to greed i promise you everyone would be in jail from this like fuck dude like i can't play music no more it just doesn't make sense in my head this is probably one of the number one reasons i've never done a like a walkthrough video where i played a game from beginning to end dude i wanted to play the black ops campaign beginning to end but i was just so paranoid because of the music and like dude it, it's just it's such a headache if you want me to be honest with you like 20 years down the line fucking mcdonald's and in and out are gonna have a war over who owns red and yellow like fuck dude what's up with these companies thinking that they own things like you guys remember when apple a year ago was trying to fucking have a whole lawsuit over that one app using a pear as their logo like apple you do not own fruit dude like it's pretty pathetic that these companies think they're 
this powerful and i mean they kind of are but it's it's getting too far dude it's getting way too far it's not even about protection anymore it's more about violation and they're trying to violate our rights as like citizens if you want me to be honest this is crazy if it wasn't for the average person these music companies wouldn't be shit when people hear stories on their instagram of music and we're that's like one of the main ways people spread music and well within teenagers i believe that because i'm a teenager myself that's how i fucking hear a lot of the songs that i like, like i see someone post a, a screenshot of the, what they're listening to or i hear someone listening to music in the car and their snapchat story that's how most people find out about music i don't think most people use the fucking radio anymore in terms of teenagers most people just use ox or fucking bluetooth and play what they want through spotify or apple music a uh, scary world we live in dude people think they own everything